what is up you guys it's your girl unique the iconic and we're back with another video so in today's video we're going to do a watercolor method on this mink hair weave in 24 inches it is the blonde hair and it is straight i am using cajun spice and ginger adore hair color i'm using one bottle of cajun spice and one bottle of ginger per two per each two bundles so i have four bundles all in total um, so I am using my Joy Co conditioner from my last watercolor video. If you have not watched it, I'll put it in my description. But we're using some hot water and we're going to put some conditioner in it so that it can be a little conditioned as we're watercoloring it. All right, so make sure you mix it up really, really well. Um, funny story is that my hair was supposed to be a ginger orange color. But somewhere down the line, since I've dyed it, it's just been like this orange kind of color but i like it you know people say it complements my skin well so i've just been sticking to it so we're going to put all of that hair dye from the bottle into the water we're still going to save the bottle for later of course you'll see why make sure you mix it up really 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 well because you want to make sure that all of the color is mixed together because if not it can kind of leave some weird streaks of color in your hair i can't explain it like one blotch of dye may get on your hair and it will cause it to like have this one super bright color i can't explain it but just make sure you mix it really really well so yeah i'm mixing that thing up um like i say if you're not new to my channel then you already know i chew my tongue that's just what i do don't mind me that's me and it ain't going nowhere but bam Bam, 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 bam. You know, I'm always going to shake some ass on my channel, okay? It's just naturally me. But yeah, so we're going to take two bundles. So I'm taking two bundles and I am dying, dipping them like back and forth, up and down, swirling around all in this water because I want all of this hair dye to be absorbed. Like I need all of it, all of it. Give it all to me. But um yeah, so um if you're looking at my hair right now with this curly hair, I got this curly hair from Mink Hair Weave as well. I forgot the inch of the curly hair, but um I think it was about 22 inches. I only got three bundles, but I'm getting four bundles this time because I want my hair to be really full for my birthday, which you will see later in the vlog how it came out. But can y'all just see that color, like how pretty it is? Like it's just so pretty. <laughs> it's so cute. I love it, love it, love it. But yeah, so I ended up getting um, another, about half a bottle of the Cajun Spice and Ginger from another bottle of hair that I had left over and dipping, I'm sorry, not dipping, but pouring more hair color into the bowl so I can have my bundles more saturated because I really didn't want it to be that light. I kind of wanted it to be a little darker. I really want the color to pop and be very, very vibrant. So I just ended up adding some more hair dye to the bowl and i did that for um the next batch of bundles as well so you see me naturally getting the water into the bottle where the hair dye is and i'm just going to go ahead and swish that around and try to get all of that hair dye listen we don't want to leave nothing behind you need it all i promise y'all you want to get as much hair dye as you can um you can also add more um bundles i'm sorry not more bundles more hair dye to your bowl but i would just recommend you just take you know two bottles at a time the more hair dye you add the more saturated it will be like it will be very very vibrant um but i didn't want mine to be too bright especially because my color was already fading at the top of my hair so yeah so we're just mixing it in I'm adding that other half of one of the hair dyes I had left over in. So you'll see here, that's what I'm doing because I really want that color to be super saturated. Um, so what you will also see is that my hair, it looks like it's getting matted. That's because I was being kind of lazy when I was dyeing this hair, y'all. Because of the tangling process after this, I wish I was being more responsible and more careful. So please, you guys, don't don't be me. Don't be me acting like how I was just right now, acting crazy. Because you'll be over there struggling trying to tangle the hair like how I was. 
But um, yes, just please take your time. Make sure you try to detangle the hair as you're dyeing it for it ends up like how it was just there. But yeah, so after I did this same process with the next two bundles, I went ahead and I used cold water to rinse out any dye that was left over. Then I went with my Joico Moisture Shampoo. I shampooed the bundles. And then I went ahead and I went and added more conditioner, let the hair sit in the conditioner, just like soak it all up. And I detangled it and then let the hair air dry. I know some people say you're not supposed to shampoo your hair after a color, but I personally recommend it only because it'll get over the leftover dye that's in your hair that you don't want to come out, you know. So yeah, I just recommend shampooing it. Not a lot of shampoo, just a little bit, just to get that smell from the hair dye and to get the excess hair dye that's been left over that the hair didn't get to absorb. But as y'all can see when I was saying earlier, like how I was being so lazy and did not like shampoo this hair. I'm not shampoo detangled this hair properly. It just got all matted, but the shedding wasn't that bad. I just used a lot of conditioner and some water and we were good to go. But please don't be me. Please take your time. Please, please do. Because it was, that took me about an hour to detangle all that hair without me having to get major shedding. But yeah, um, other than that, you guys, at the end, you'll see the reveal. How my hair came out. It was so cute. I'm a baby. Because I'm a baby. You feel me? Eh. Eh. Period, boo. Period. But anyways, yeah. Y'all see, your girl was struggling. I was. But anyways, let's fast forward and look at my hair. It was bomb. Fire. I'm Ginger, the spicy mommy. Ooh. Anyways, like I said, like, comment, subscribe. Thank y'all. Love y'all. Mwah.